Yo, what's happening everyone? It's your boy here, Abdurrahim, back again with another great, amazing tech video. Where well, the video today is all about the Infinix Note 6. Well, is something which is so new about this kind of device or it's just that like last year device we have seen it from the Infinix Note 5 which was running stock Android. And I think to my own kind of aspect, this is the two devices that supported them running stock Android. If you guys remember back in the days, there were like three years past there's a certain new phoenix was running uh stock android to which was supported by google and all the updates were like flawless but right now or oh, last year we are seeing something which is quite different like the note 5 which has um stock android while the note 6 have xos now what's the big difference here and uh what's the full specification of the Note 6. Well, let's get started. I think first, the Note 6 is very improved when it comes to stylus. Well, right from the box, I really got inspired with the stylus, how it looks like, and uh, how they just uh, made up with the stylus, how it's gonna be. Because it looks like the Samsung Galaxy Note 5, if you just pay close attention on the stylus part, just, you can tell no difference with Note 5 head to head when it's uh, on that kind of spot. And I think to my own kind of aspect, uh, on this kind of device, the body, it's just just normal body, just like 2018 still, we're not seeing something which is quite vibrous, like uh, we have seen it from different devices having those kind of um, top notch out of it, like the, the screen and the bezels are quite different, but this one is just still having those kind of ingredients of 2018. Another kind of stuff we're seeing the new MediaTek Helio P35. I think to my own kind of aspect, this is something which is good, a big change out of uh, Note 6. They like went to a, throughout another different type of uh, processor type, which I think to my own kind of aspect, it has more uh, performance and uh, it has that kind of things which are so ingredients when it comes to the device. Something else about this device, it has a four gigabyte of RAM. Now you won't get disappointed with how much RAM it has or how much performance it has and uh, this kind of device when it runs on XOS just know that there are a lot of bloatwares and ad ads advertisements too much advertisement and something which I think the more kind of aspect is a downside of it because a lot of users they just want some something clean something nice something clean setup out of the uh, out of the phone and I think to my own kind of aspect for the Infinix Note 6 and uh, Infinix devices having those XOS it's something which is not that much legitimate so I think to my own kind of aspect if they just do that kind of roundup of their launches and then make something which is uh, more minimal for us users to not get those kind of much advertisement and uh, just to interact with the devices when it comes to network, actually 100%, it uses 4G. It uses 4G for 4G networks and WCDMA for 3G networks and even 2G. But I think from my own kind of aspect, we have just got used to that and uh, we are just getting surprised if they can launch 5G. I know 5G technology is just upcoming one and people they're just uh, winding out, out of it. But I think tomorrow kind of aspect might be much, much better if we just consume 5G. And in my country, they didn't even just start doing some installation and out of it, but it might, it might be much better for the future. You know, if they do the installation and you have a device up and running and still have that kind of support 5G, it might be, it might be something which is so important. So I think tomorrow kind of aspect Aspect on this kind of device is just very nice when it comes to this kind of new specification of 2019. Something else we are seeing a triple camera. Now you get surprised throughout triple camera. We have seen it from the Techno Phantom 9. If you guys didn't check out that video, just click this card and check it out. But don't just run and check out that video. You check out on the end of this video. Now you go love something which is so beautiful. It's triple camera. Now triple camera technology we have seen it is much kind of like. A lot of people are going through it, but is it that much important for the triple camera? Well, we have seen it surprisingly from the Google Pixel 3. Now, I'll just give you a hint there. So, Pixel 3 uses only one single camera out of it, and they just don't use multiple cameras because the software plays big role. Now, when it comes to Infinix, they decided to use only hardware so as it can play much better with the software. Now, I think to my own kind of aspect is not such a big deal since they're just giving you all the features just like the 
Pixel 3 how it performs on the camera not a hundred percent how Pixel 3 performs on the camera but you're getting those features like bokeh you're getting those picture features like portrait you're getting those features like wide picture and stuff like that it might not touch like Pixel 3 but it has those kind of things which a Pixel 3 has it but the camera performance out of it is not that much much great because it wobbles it, the images wobbles around so I, I think to my own kind of aspect is the camera sensor or i think to my own kind of aspect it's just that mm, mm, in the next they go fix that on the software i think let us just wait and cl close our fingers and wait for the moment whereby they might roll out an update on the front camera side we are seeing a 16 megapixel camera i think to my own kind of aspect 16 megapixel camera is just way to go there and it's something which is quite amazing to my own kind of aspect because you get those kind of selfie ar and stuff like that. now when it comes to battery on this kind of device it tracks 4000 million per battery now 4000 million per battery you can compare with the techno phantom 9 which mm, yeah yeah i know what you're getting it's like note 6 has more ingredients compared to the note um uh compared to the phantom 9 now i think some one kind of aspect the note devices which they're just purely having those kind of stylus they might have a lot of million per battery because of how they perform now it doesn't mean that the stylus just is the one which got that kind of uh, ma of battery which can consume but the consumption of battery depends on how much you perform on the device now i think the one kind of aspect the note 6 racks on the 4000 million per battery which i think to my own kind of aspect is something which is so amazing and legitimate and it gives you for a normal user it might give you almost two days but for that kind of heavy duty user it might give you only one day and that kind of like you get that kind of backup of a power i think among the aspect like you know that kind of 10 minutes 15 minutes for you before the battery dies but i think the morning aspect is something which is so great out of it and the colors out of it they're so amazing of these devices for the color side we have midnight black we have the blue and we have the mocha brown i think to my own kind of aspect for these colors they sound so vibrant out of the device and this is the Note 6. Now you won't get something which is quite different than the Note 5. So they're just slightly just some things which here and here they're just minor upgrade. So I think to my own kind of aspect, this is something which is so surprisingly and something which is so good from the Infinix, but which are downside of it. So jumping out of it is just that is this device suits for you? Well, to the scale of 10 to 0, this device just runs out of 6. Well, you can just purchase this device, but there's no slightly just something which is like from the last year not five so if you are like that kind of hype of infinix well this device is actually for you but just know that get those kind of bloatwares and a lot of ads which can slow down your phone but out of it is just that it doesn't differentiate from the last year's device of infinix which means it's not five so i think to my own kind of aspect stock android is much better considered to the xos that's to me that's my perspective to just clean that down and start saying abdu what's up what's going on it's just come on brother so yeah that's what it is what it is so thank you guys for watching you love this video today make sure you hit the thumbs up if you're new here my name is abdu i want to go <coughs> My name is Abdurrahim13. By the way, I'll talk about it. So, yeah, that's what it is, what it is. I'm going to catch you guys on the next one. As always, stay sharp and creative and peace.